Hello, hello, and welcome back to Fallout New Vegas. Uh, new recording session on my end, so it's been a hot minute. Ooh. That. Oh, it's in his hand. I was going to be like, that looks rough. All right. Uh, we have a broken limb, huh? Um, do I have any doctor's bags? Shit. There we go. Uh oh. Okay, we're not in the best of shape, huh? Okay, hang on. Here's what we're gonna do. Let me just... Take everything off Eddie and do... I'm, I'm gonna open this episode up with a little bit of rundown of our inventory and think about stuff we might want to do. Some crafting inventory management trying to heal ourselves because with a broken limb we're not exactly in the best of condition right now and we need really need to weigh out what we should be carrying with us and what we shouldn't uh talk let me access your volunteer tool to make something is there anything i want to make uh i i could break weapon repair kit i can grow those do some overcharging let's not recycle those yet all right so nothing i want to do in terms of crafting uh what about ammo work um okay hang on let me look at what weapons i'm carrying around again I want five, five, six rounds. Shotgun shells, 10 mil. That uses E cells. And that uses LR. Okay. Oh, no. Dude, that's not what I'm holding my mouse over. Jesus. I hate how it does that sometimes. All right. What am I shy on to make anything? It's mostly cases that I'm gonna need, right? Yeah, I'm just missing hulls. All right. I don't have the resources to cure my, my, oh, my numerous crippled limbs. Let's at least feed and hydrate ourselves. We don't really need either of those, huh? Okay. Am I tired? I'm very tired, so if I have food that will wake me up, I should definitely eat that. Let's drink the Nuka Colas. And I think I have some Sunset Sarsaparilla as well, unless I've drunk all of that. Oh, that one doesn't wake me up like Nuka Cola does, huh? Sixty-two. Um. What do we want to eat? Let's eat a gecko steak. All right. We're in pretty rough condition. What? No. Uh. Trait. There. There we go. All right, and let's start off by giving him. A bunch of our foodstuffs. Or no, let's start off by giving him junk stuff. Get some of that out of our inventory. 
Oh, yeah, that didn't have any weight, did it? Uh, anything that has weight. Take the leather belt. Little spoon. Take those, take that, take that. All right, now we're gonna start giving them some of our food to carry for us. We gotta find a place to boil up all that dirty water and get the supplies to do it. Mm. We're very much in that uh, mild area of suffering from success and that we're carrying around way more stuff than we need, you know? Oh, okay. They can't carry a one pound thing. There we go, give them some of that. Ooh, we should read that pugilism illustrated. Oh, apparently I have rum and nuke. Uh, I don't think there's much else we can give them. Alright. Let's read that pugilism in illustrated. And was it F6 to save, quick save or F5? F5. F6 is quick load. Okay. So we're a little rough in condition. We should poke through more of these ruins to see if we can't find something to fix our leg before making our way back up to the uh, Mojave outpost. Oh my god. Hmm. We got a house over here. Let's pop our head in this. Ugh. Door to Nipton Hotel. Hmm. Figures that they would have been picked of all their weapons. Oh, apparently not. Hunting revolver. Uses government rounds. Does 40 da 23 damage per shot compared to the 15 at 50 DPS, 40 DPS. So more damage per shot, but less damage uh, per second. All right. Hmm. How the fuck is this a hotel? Ah. Real though, where are all the beds? This is a pretty shit hotel. Honestly, for walking on a broken leg, we're not doing terrible. Hmm. Let's head this way uptown and then we'll head back down the main street hitting those homes. So we got a house here we can search. Meeting people, nice. A reloading bench if I need. Oh, Jesus. Hmm. 
Hmm. So whoever lived here looked to be pretty well equipped. Ammo box. I'll take that, whatever that is. A recipe. Well, I'm over encumbered. And we'll worry about fixing that when we get to the main, next main town, I think. We're already moving slower on account of our broken limb anyway. They're not going to need all this food anymore. Got a lot of booze in there. You got some milk over in the corner. All right. Can you tell I have a loot goblin problem when I play these games? God, I can't jump because I'm over encumbered. Okay, maybe we should. All right, here's what we're going to do. We're going to... I feel bad dropping all this stuff, though. Hang on. We'll leave a bunch of it in a home here. Oh, yeah. These two skeletons. I think if I approach them... It's going to do it. Star, it's uh, Luke Skywalker's parents from Star Wars. It's a wild wasteland encounter. That's so upsetting. Oh, that's so upsetting. Oh, the fucking crashes. The fucking crashes. You can't do this to me, Fallout New Vegas. Okay, come on. Okay, auto saved when we left the building, at least. God, why are we getting the out of memory uh, issue so fucking frequently? I have so many mods. If you guys know of more mods that can fix things that I haven't listed in the mod list I have that make me not have this uh, issue of the game crashing, let me know. Uh, let's drink some booze for increased strength. Nah, there we go. Now we are. No, we're still over encumbered. We don't have any buff out, huh? And I can't drink different kinds of alcohol to stack the effect. All right, yeah. Let's walk into this house over here. And we'll leave what, some stuff in the fridge here, I think. The broken leg is really a fucking problem. I might make this episode a little longer because of how much we're limping along. Nice position, nice. Every day is a good day to die. Oh god. That's a robot attacking me. Um Where is it? Not that. No, I I could have sworn I had a shotgun. Caravan shotgun, there we go. Eddie's pinning me in the corner. Woo! Well, that was scary. Metal tubing. What is that for? Welding gun? Cool. terminal. 
recent mainframe connection specifications. Things are finally looking up. I got both gutsies up and running, and this uh, terminal working too, so I can keep a regular journal. Fix up the terminal for Mayor Ste uh, Steering too, so he can run a run his new that run his numbers and got a free turn with Rose's payment. Dare I say? Yeah. All I need now is for a new gal to uh, come to Nipton, one who doesn't know anything about me. If I can get her to show. Uh, to, if I can get to her and show her my uh, gutsies before anyone else can tell her or can turn her against me, uh, she'll be impressed and that'll do it. It has to do it. It's not like every man out there can fix up a robot. I'll tell her she'd never have to do housework. That'd be the. The. There we go. Clincher. It would be nice uh, to not have to pay Rosie. Excuse me. This writing stuff is harder than I thought. It's harder than I thought. I better stop here. P.S. For maximum impact, only show one gutsy to the gal. Let admiration take hold, then reveal the second gutsy. There's a second gutsy. Uh, I can't use that to fix my caravan shotgun. Ooh, and a, a plasma rifle, a plasma pistol, and a magnum. Cool. I can use that to fix up my leather armor a little. I can't. I, I got a problem. It's so hard for me to not just loot everything I see. I feel like that metal tubing can come in handy, potentially. Legion ER, Jesus. What's that armor in the corner? Oh, god damn it, I'm over encumbered so I can't get to it. Okay, hang on. Inch our way forward, come on. Eddie, out of the way. We're gonna use this guy's refrigerator to store a bunch of our food. Let's just grab whatever food he has lying around so we don't forget to later. All right, and now, take that coffee pot too. Let's see here. So let's put away a whole bunch of food. Not what I wanted to do. Da da da. And I can just grab all this when I'm on my way back after I've sold a bunch of stuff up in the uh, nearby town. Up in the, the trade outpost. Beans, potato crisps. Oh, I didn't want to drop that in. Give me that back. away half the purified water. All right. Now we're not over encumbered. Good. Alright, um... 
I need a lockpick of 50. What is my lockpick at right now? So if I read that locksmith reader... Where is that? Locksmith reader, and now I can do this. Damn it. Come on. God damn it. There we go. Nice. All right, let's, uh, what do we want to raise? Let's leave that there because we can still get that good with magazines. Now with a magazine, I can get that up to 75, which is enough to do another, the next level of lock, I'm pretty sure. And I'm over encumbered again! Eddie! Here's what we're gonna do. Give me all your food. Oh, come on. I can... And take all of the junk I'm carrying. All right, now let me buy, let me buy, and we will once again store a bunch of food in here. Ta -ta. I'm good at video games. that on us all right leather armor nice let's drop a quick save in case the game crashes again and let's continue exploring this town in hopes of finding a fucking doctor's bag for our broken leg There's another house over here. Hmm. Not finding anything of exceptional appearance in this house yet. Take all that. Lots of booze in this town. City full of alcoholics. Looks like they had a trailer park. Some of their folks died over here. Oh, it looks like this person fought back. Disintegrated a legionary. What are these plastic parts I keep finding everywhere? I feel like I should take it. Hmm. Oh, Jesus. 
God, that effect is terrible. Oh, there's not a doctor in Mojave Outpost, is there? Oh, fuck. More lottery tickets. Butter knife. What's this here? Good luck, trailer park. Seems like it was the opposite of that. Are right, we looped back around to the town entrance? So let's explore some of these homes here. Locksmith reader, nice. Still not finding a whole lot. Some wine. Take all that. Alright. Come on, let me through. Let me through. We're over encumbered again, but we'll drop off more food in that same fridge in a, in a moment. Both of those are helpful, I'm pretty sure. Use a crutch to break the sink. Hmm. Nothing much here. Let's quick save. Push through, push through. I just need something for my broken leg. Um, Eddie, I picked up some more stuff that you can carry, some more junk. There we go, not over encumbered now. Got this building here to poke around in. That's, that's scorpions, and that's a landmine. That's another landmine, and that's a tripwire. That's another tripwire. Uh, let's pull out our environment rifle. Ah, shotgun, terrifying. That's a pressure plate. Well, this house is a nightmare. Careful. job. I was trying to jump over the plate and I, I triggered it instead. Grenade rifle, Patriot's cookbook and some grenades. We can fix up our grenade rifle we have with that. Or not, because they seem to be different grenade rifles that use different ammo. Oh. Shit. Let's 
So that's a completely different model of grenade rifle that I don't have any grenades for. Oh, that was almost bad. Declaration of Vital Essence. Everything in this house is locked. This guy was a fucking prepper. have another locksmith book. Eh, not much help. Uh, miscellaneous notes. Ah, it recalls. Hereby declare Sir Proprietorship of Vital Essence and claim it here to all legitimate reign, rights and defend, defending said essence versus all karmers. QED. Town's been going to hell ever since Mayor Steer and waltzed in from out west saying he'd put Nipton on the map. Well, we know the real reason he came to town. He come from our Vital Essence! And then, more come. The town's been growing by the day. All of them coming from a vital essence, as if I didn't know it. And then more come, asking questions like, Hey, why you spend all your time in that house of yours? You got something special in there? Sniff around for my essence is what they're doing. I've had enough. I'm looking up my essence, and I'm setting up defenses. No one's going to get their hands on my vital essence except old Harry himself. Come what may, Harry Collins. Right, so this guy was insane. No. I'm trying to look at the scorpions. Okay, none of them have loot. Alright, let's go drop off more food in that same place. There was another gun trap set up right at the front door. God, come on. We just carry too much food around with us, the issue, you know? Again, suffering from success. Da -da -dum. Swing over here. Drop off more food in this one. I'm gonna keep one and I'll drink it to increase my carry weight. Eh, whatever. I didn't mean to put away that healing powder, but I'll, I'll just put it away. It's fine. Nice. Meeting people, meant tats, Mississippi Review, New Cola. There we go. And we're low. We're no longer over encumbered again. We got a couple more buildings to poke around in. So let's check out this one. Lots of loot in this town. Uh, I'll take those. I'll take all that. Hmm. Some BBs. Take. I'll take all that. I'll take that. All right. God, we're never gonna be want for at want for food again. Another Nipton house.
All right. So much food in this town. Anything good here? No. All right. Ooh, hang on. One more cabinet. Some bottle caps. And it looks like we got one more building. The... What is this? Nipton Trading Post. Yeah, if any place is going to have a doctor's bag, it's going to be here. Oh, there's a guy here. Not much else. Are you fucking kidding me? First, I get my leg smashed, and then in walks the Powder Ganger's grim fucking Reaper. What the fuck have you got against us, man? Jesus fucking Christ! If you want me dead, just give me 15 medics and I'll fucking OD for you, okay? Fuck! Uh... How did you survive? Luck, that's how. I'm just that fucking lucky. You're looking at the second place winner of the Nipton Lottery. That asshole Swanick took first place. So him they let walk. Tell me more about this lottery. It ain't like we came to Nipton to play it. Me and my crew had it worked out to kidnap some NCR troopers who come to town to get laid. Had it all worked out with the scumbag mayor. We were going to ransom them off, keep their weapons for ourselves, a nice score. How'd the plan go wrong? We get in position, and next thing we know, we're surrounded by those fucking Legion freaks. They dragged us and everybody else into the center of town. And that asshole with a dog on his head, he starts talking about how we're bad people. He said we needed to be punished for what we did. Not all of us, but some of us. And then he gives everyone a fucking lottery ticket. What happened once everyone had their tickets? What do you think? He started drawing tickets and that's how people got punished. First up was the lucky losers. They got decapitated. Guess that's lucky cause it's pretty quick. Then came the crucifixions. God damn, but those went on and on and on. Third place runners up got enslaved. I got the fuck beat out of my legs, and the winner, they let go free. What happened to the mayor? Him? When his ticket came up, they burned him alive on a pile of tires. <laughs> Deserved. So why are you still here? I don't know. I just love it here. What the fuck do you think, asshole? Prize for second place was I got to live, but they beat my fucking legs with hammers. I'm fucking crippled, get it? I can spare medics. And you're a fucking dream come true, ain't you? How much you gonna give me? One. Big fucking deal. Hand it over. You said some people were enslaved? Yeah, a bunch of those Legion fucks dragged them off right away. They were headed east, if you're feeling heroic. I'll see if I can save them if I find them. Don't act like you'd be doing me a favor. I don't give a fuck. Alright. Bye. See ya. All right, we're not going to loot any of the food in here. I will take that salesman weekly. But I do want to find a doctor's bag for myself if I can. There we go. Doctor's bag anywhere, please. We'll leave the food down there for him if he, in case he needs it. Hmm. Well, shit. Looks like we're limping our way up to that other place in hopes of the, uh, up to the trade outpost. And we'll be heading up that way, back to try and maybe sell some shit and get some help. Hang on, let's... Let's quickly look at all the food we have. That we stored. Oh, sorry about that. 
Let's actually go through this and figure out what we want to ditch and what we'd want to sell. Alright, I don't care about this. I'll take the atomic cocktail. I don't like pre-war food. We have so much cooked food, I don't really need to worry about taking food for quick- God damn it, fucking- Take those, that. Take that lad's life. Take the maze. You know, let's take these, uh, who are they? All this. Yeah, let's actually be picky with this food a little bit. Take all that purified water. Um, sorry, side distraction. Uh, take the Rubus casserole. Take the Salisbury. Uh, no, I don't want the Salisbury steaks. Hang on. I think I picked up some stuff I don't want in the other buildings, so let's quickly get rid of some of that. We're at a point where we can be picky, and I don't like the idea of eating gross food, pre-war food that's been sitting there for decades. And if we can drink water instead of alcohol, that's much better for us, so let's leave behind all the alcohol. Alright. And now, Eddie. Eddie, my love. Give me everything I gave you. Keep fucking doing that. Um, let's give him all of our food to carry. Oh, I don't want that cram. Oh, give me that healing powder. You know, I want to primarily use them as a, a refrigerator, you know? Give me that stealth boy back, please. All right, and now give me a second. Let's put away some of that food that I don't give a fuck about. Now we've looted this whole town, picked through things and sort of determined some of what we want. Uh, there's also some stuff I want to drop. I don't need that many coffee pots or that many coffee cups.
still need a trust board. I want to keep one because I'm pretty sure I can use it to craft something eventually. Drop that cutting board. Back over here. Oh, that uh, visual glitch doesn't look like a good thing. Come on. I'm hitting the eight. I'm hitting. The A key to say okay. Oh, he can't carry that many. That's what the issue is. Hmm. I wish that when you did that, it would just give them the as much as it possibly can, instead of just being like, nope, none. I take none. Okay, we're still having an issue of over encumberment. Let me save because I'm worried the game's gonna crash. It's like, hang on. I want to craft weapon repair kits, right? What am I missing to do that? Leather belt, duct tape, and not enough repair. Not by a long shot. Okay. Ugh, hang on. Adjusting my headset a little. And then the weapon repair kit, if I wanted to do that. I have a lot of the supplies I need, I just don't have the... You know, the, the fucking repair stat. I hate, I hate this visual bug. It makes me nervous whenever I see it. All right, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna open this tool cabinet. I don't need a nine iron. I don't need the hunting revolver either. Let's break down some ammos we're not using. Come on. No. The wheel is so annoying sometimes how it doesn't work the way you want it to. I'd like to make some ammo. I, okay. I can, oh, break down. No, that's the 12, 20 gauge. Where's the government rounds? Can I not break down government rounds? All right, let's make some 10 mil. Let's put those away because I don't have any use for them. I don't have a 12 gauge shotgun. Why can't I break those down? I don't have use for that ammo. Get rid of those BBs.
Yeah, I'm carrying around a lot of stuff I don't need. Okay. Honestly, as cool as the grenade rifle is, I can just throw normal grenades if I wanted that to do that. Oh my god, I'm still over encumbered, huh? Um Fuck it. We don't need that 10 millimeter pistol. It's more it's more weight than it's worth. A lot of uh, inventory management at the end of this session. Now let's just go ahead over here. Grab ourselves a beer. Yeah. Throw that back. It's really forcing me to pick and shoot. Oh, that looks fucking bad. I feel like we're approaching a crash. Um, okay. So we're probably gonna wrap this YouTube recording here. Uh, but keep going with Twitch. But on the Twitch end, I'm gonna have to close and reset the game in order to prevent a crash, clearly. God, this game has such memory issues. I hope you've all been enjoying this episode of Fallout New Vegas, and cars will be appearing in a moment and come back next week for more. Love all you very, very much, and ta-ta for now.